morning, friends. Thank you for joining me for another chit chat on the porch with our coffee. It's Sunday morning and it's a beautiful morning. It's cloudy, it's chilly, but it feels like fall. And fall is my favorite, favorite time of year. I can hear the birds singing and caulking and I'm sure you can hear them too. And I have my morning coffee here with me and my favorite Starbucks mug that's even my Christmassy mug, but I use it all year long. I have two of them actually. So um, I have my hot coffee here and I am ready for a wonderful and blessed day. I woke up this morning and I told myself this day is going to be what I make it. And I'm going to make it a very happy, enjoyable memories, uh, making memories and uh, getting some things done that I've been neglecting. So um, since I'm not able to drive uh, due to my falling asleep, at different times or being drowsy um, they've advised me to not drive until they get everything straightened out so um, hubby is going to take me this afternoon and I ask him to drop me off in the plaza at our <clears throat> excuse me our mall area and there there is a Dollar Tree a Kirkland's a five below and a super target so I said just drop me off you know, Target, I can use the electric cart, so I'm not walking on my foot. Um, I have seen they've got some great Halloween and fall um, things, and I would like to get some, a little, little more fall decor, um, since I am changing it a little bit. Last year I changed it, and I'm changing it a little more this year, um, away from the traditional bright colors and going more towards the muted and more neutral colors uh, in our home. So I'd like to go there. Um, I would like to go to Dollar Tree because I do have a couple collaborations I'm doing with other YouTubers and we're doing a swapping of uh, YouTube items. Or, I'm sorry, of Dollar Tree items. Um, so I wanna be able to go to Dollar Tree and and walk around there and check things out and uh, see what I can find. Um, you know, I told him I'll walk. If I get tired, I'll sit down. If I get too tired, I'll call him to come pick me up. Um, but someone has to be home with mom. Um, we can't leave her more than about 15 or 20 minutes at the most at a time. Uh, so that's about 15, 10, 15 minutes away from our home. So, um, I'm going to do that this afternoon. Um, personally, I would prefer to do it this morning because I am a morning person or a late night, early morning person. Um, but my husband goes to his grandfather's on Sunday. Um, we have Sunday brunch or Sunday dinners at grandpa's house. And unfortunately, mom and I haven't been able to go for the last few months because of her health declining. But my husband, I make sure that he goes um, because his mother lives with his grandfather to take care of him. And um, I just don't want him to miss out on any memories or any time with his mom um, that he may have. So, um, yeah, he was going to go to dad and that would give mom and I a chance to has some girl time. Um, I am going to polish my toes, her toes, and my nails teal today um, for ovarian cancer awareness. If you're not already aware from all my posts, <laughs> if you follow me on Instagram or Facebook, uh, September is Ovarian Cancer Awareness Month, and teal is the color to wear. So I always promote it in my salon um, if you get a manicure or pedicure and chose teal polish, 100% of the proceeds went to the National Ovarian Cancer, Co Cancer Coalition, uh, the Chicago chapter. 
So, I am eager to get my teal toes and my teal fingernails back on um, and get mom's done for her um, update. She wanted, actually suggested, asked last night if we wanted to play cards or play a board game. So we did. We played Yahtzee. She did really well. Um, she won, actually. <laughs> Which I was, I was happy for her. Um, I was a little skeptical at first, or worried that maybe, you know, with her medications and everything, with her sense of memory or cognitive, you know, her cognitive um, thoughts and things would be there. And she was slick as a ribbon. So, uh, which was a big surprise compared to earlier in the day when I had to call the hospice nurse. Um, I couldn't get her awake to take her medication in the afternoon at two. And I was scared to death. I thought for sure that that was the beginning of the end. And I was not prepared for that at all. I don't think I'll ever be prepared for that. Um, but this is a positive video, and I'm not going to cry, and I'm not going to dwell on that. Let's just say she's doing better. Um, things are more positive in the home. Um, my son is away at his girlfriend's this weekend. However, he will be home tomorrow. Um, we were able to get some indoor cleaning done um, earlier this week. Um, that had been neglected. You know, ceiling fans are my worst nightmare. I love my ceiling fans. Could not live without my ceiling fans um, because of the air circulation. Otherwise, I get so stuffy and congested. But, oh, my gosh, I hate to clean them. And with two dogs that shed, one being a German Shepherd, that is covered in hair, All you know, almost immediately so um yeah we cleaned those yesterday um got those taken care of um let me see what else can i share with you um i think that's about it i am going to do finally i'm going to any old way i have to bootleg this phone to get it to stand up so I can video my videos for you today on my hauls that I have to share with you. I am going to do it. Uh, it may be on a stack of boxes with a Coke bottle behind it to hold it up, but I'm going to make sure that I have the <laughs> this video up for you. So with uh, that being said, I'm going to go ahead and let you enjoy your Sunday uh, with your family and friends. Um, I hope you all have a wonderful and blessed day. I thank you for joining me here on my channel. If this is your first time here, I welcome you. Thank you for joining us. And please think about subscribing. Just would hit the red subscribe down in the bottom uh, of the video here. So, um, okay, folks. That's it. I will see you soon. Everyone, God bless. And have a great, great day. Bye-bye.